Good morning. Oh, it's actually 1.42. But good afternoon, girlies and the gays. Not this vlog. Um, it's actually, yeah, like I said, it's 1.42 in the afternoon. I've been up since 10, just kind of getting it together. Did my makeup. Can y'all see? She's kind of beat. Did a little bun moment. You know me, you know I love a good whatever this is, rat's nest at the top. This vlog is just going to kind of be like a come with me restock a few things let me read the list of what where we're gonna go and what we need i don't need a lot of hygiene or really i don't need anything but things that i want to go out and get just to like restock on we're gonna do that today target or walmart i might go to walmart i'm not gonna lie like i know the girlies love a good target haul but my wallet loves a good walmart haul so that's probably what we're gonna do either target or walmart i need to get some more candles i need to get bathroom fresheners tripod for this camera i don't know we'll see like where i'm gonna go because i feel like i'm gonna go to walmart for the tripod and i really don't want to be running around to like seven different stores and get one thing at each store so we will see what we're gonna do with that okay so i kind of threw on this little like scarf moment because it's cold out here in cali i know it probably don't seem like it's cold but it's cold 50 degrees is cold i don't care what anybody say that's cold this little thing is from forever 21 and i love it i dried the pants and the jacket bad choice bad fucking choice and the pants they were very long the pants were very long of me at first so i was like hmm if i dry them maybe they won't shrink so much no, them bitches is at my ankles now. And they look bad. At first, like, my Uggs would puddle over it and it would look good. Now, those are in the house pants. Now I have to retry it again because I've, it, it, it's just bad. But, whatever. Yeah, we're just going to throw in this little purse. This is nothing too crazy. Just a little purse to throw my little stuff in, my lip gloss, my wallet. You know, the thing. So, I'm just going to get this purse together, get myself together so we can get out this house. Next time you will see me, we will be in the car. All right? All right, bye. I actually decided to stop and get some gas because, baby, that gas is running low. And I don't want to just be driving around with no gas. And I just need to get some gas. So we're going to do that first. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kicked it. And by the way, just got in town Then I won't let you me this cloud I lied. We're at Ulta. I wanted to come to Ulta first because honestly, it's just closer, or not closer, it's further out from everything else that I want to stop at. So I'm trying to do, you know, furthest for first and then just keep moving towards home. On the list again to see what we need from here because I'm going to try to stick with this list. I'm going to make sure, I'm trying to make sure I don't overdo it, but you know me. I need some setting spray. I need to either, I'm, I'm debating if I'm going to get both again. I don't think I'm going to get the Morphe setting spray anymore just because I feel like it doesn't really do anything and it's just making my face extra wet and it's not like mattifying or setting anything in. So I don't think I'm going to get that no more. Um, I have been using the fucking, what's that brand? Too Faced Hangover setting spray. I think I'm going to go pick that back up. I'm going to get this face kit for my friend Kayla and I'm going to look for a lip mask. Look for it. I'm not going to even try to get one, but we're going to look for one. If we find one that I like, I'll get it. So, yeah, let's go. Hello, how are you? Okay, so I'm over in the Too Faced section, and this is the one that I usually get. But I think I'm going to try this. Let me see. This one looks like... I don't know. Actually, use this one, but I think we're gonna go with this one today, or maybe we'll get both. I'm in the good molecule section. I think I found the one that I want. This is the one I was talking about that I bought from my other friend. And I think that's all I'm gonna get, honestly, because I don't really feel like looking for a lip mask. So, you know what? I'm gonna go look for some real technique brushes. All night. Say it. I want all 
Seatbelt on everything. I'm ready to go. Yeah, also, I probably shouldn't say this on camera, but Ulta is expensive. And, you know, back when I was doing what I had to do to get what I had to get, I used to pray for times like this to rhyme like this. So I had. I didn't pick care about what I picked up because I wasn't looking at no price. I was just getting what I needed to get. But now it's like, now that I actually got in line to pay for this shit, I'm like. $80 for four fucking items? <sighs> Whatever. 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 All right, y'all. So we made it to Walmart. So let's go in the store and pick up the stuff so we can get back home. Okay, so we made it into the candle section. Honestly, they don't have too many options. They don't really... Hmm. That's interesting. I don't really have anything good. I'm kind of sad because I came here for candles. None of these are giving. This is nice. A juicy watermelon. Oh, I think I'm gonna get this one. Oh, that was literally just the most like intense ass Walmart trip I've ever taken in my life. It was literally so overstimulating just now. That was weird. <laughs> Cut back to when I say in the beginning of this vlog that, oh, the girlies love Target. Like, I know the girlies love a good Target haul, but my wallet loves a good Walmart haul. My wallet gonna have to get down with the Target girlies because the way that that was just so much for literally nothing, we started off good. Walk in, start off good. They got new carts at this Walmart. I'm like, okay, they got new carts, nice little set, different little setup. I'm like, cool. I walk in to the store, there's music blaring. There's other beeping sounds going off. There's a megaphone going off. I don't even try to record in the candle aisle and it's loud, it's baby screaming. Eat the fucking, you know, I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna pick out a candle and, and, and go on by my day. Y'all know how I said I need to get the Febreze plugins. The fucking the Febreze plugins. Now Walmart being Walmart, they're locked up. You gotta press the button, have somebody come over and unlock it for you. Okay, cool, I press the button. Usually, I'm cool with waiting maybe five minutes. Usually, it's a big store, you gotta wait. I press it once, I'm standing there for a cool, I'm gonna say seven minutes, I'm like, all right. I'm not getting it, I'm not getting a response. Lady who works there, she's, I can tell she does like the online orders or the to-go orders. And I'm like, hey, can you get somebody or do you know somebody who has the key so i can get this little plugins here she's like oh you're gonna just have to stand there and wait i don't have a key oh oh, oh you want to get fucked up you want to get so i walk away because i'm just like i'm so over at this point i don't even want them no more i'm walking i ask one more person i'm like hey do you do you think you would have the um key for the the, the cage over here oh i don't but i can find somebody Why doesn't anybody have the key to this goddamn... I'm so over it. So he goes to this guy who looks like he's pulling some pallets. He looks like he's probably a, like a, a manager or something. And he asks him for the key. He has a key. Mind you, I've been standing in the Febreze in the cleaning aisle for 10 minutes. He get over to the guy asking me if he got a key. Now they starting to chop it up. He's like, oh, you want some? You, you want some? I'm like, yes. I just need to get one package of the Febreze plugins. That's all I need. He's like, Go over, get it. Cool lovely i did have a beautiful interaction with a beautiful black woman and so that made the experience all a little bit better and now we're in the car and i just want to say the next time i do this video we will be in target i'm not doing it again i'm not no walmart count your days are you guys here are you guys here because i am let's get into what we got today just a few things that we picked up nothing too crazy nothing too you know yeah we're gonna start off with Ulta. First thing that I got from there, 
I picked up, you guys saw, was the Hangover Setting Spray. It's supposed to be a primer, a setting spray, and a, like a refreshing spray. And I can say I feel like it does most. I use this, of course, to like set my face. I really don't use this as a primer, but I do like this spray. Um, also, oops. I already opened it <laughs> but i got the real techniques setting brush it looks like this got this i think this was like eight dollars what a steal yeah i just want to try this out the next thing that we got was this blemish scar and discoloration duo from good molecules this actually isn't for me this is for my co-worker my friend kayla she um i asked her if she wanted this for christmas and she said yeah so i got it for her so yeah we picked up that now we're moving on to what are we gonna do let's move on to walmart because honestly there's i just got a whole bunch of miscellaneous things from walmart the first thing that we got from walmart is just a towel <laughs> literally just a towel i really didn't need this but i love a good bath sheet not a bath towel a bath sheet because as a fluffy girly I, I love a good towel that wraps all the way around me. Yes, and it's pink. And it's pink. Do you think I could pass up on a pink fluffy towel? I think not. The next thing we got was this spot and stain remover because we have carpet and I just, I don't know. I just wanted to get it. <laughs> Honestly, I just wanted to get it because I feel like why not have it for a spot or a stain, you know? Next, we got Febreze plugins. Um, Yeah, the story about that, y'all saw in the earlier clip, but... Yeah, we got some Febreze plugins. What scent is this? Honey Berry Hula. I thought I was getting Bora Bora. Whatever. But anyway, um, I also picked up. I honestly thought this would be more expensive. They're only like three something a can. So that's cool. But I got a Downy April Fresh. And I also got a what is this? A fresh baked vanilla. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm gonna be so honest. I only bought this one because I really am not a vanilla scent type of girl. I like a more fruity, sweet type of smell. I only bought this because this bottle is just so cute. I don't know. <laughs> Something about this bottle and the little macaroons, like, it's just so cute to me. And honestly, it does smell good, so I will be using it. I put it in my bathroom or keep it in here something like that so i just got two of those and the last thing i got was the sad excuse of a candle honestly i'm going to advocate for walmart's candles but this like i said i like a fruity type of smell especially in my room this is a cranberry mandarin but i know i know what you're thinking said that's a random ass fucking smell i know they had nothing it seems like everybody's grandma and toothless bald headed mama stole all the candles. I don't know if they stole all the candles, but there was no candles in there. It was already so much going on in the store that I just felt like I needed, I had to get a candle or else I was going to be sad that I didn't get a candle. So I got a candle. And honestly, this smells good, but it smells more like wax than it does the scent. We'll light it up and we'll see how that goes. And oh one more thing the last thing tripod let's open this up let i'm gonna show y'all first of all let me show you guys what is even <laughs> let me show you guys what's even my setup right now because it's a little sad it's not as sad as it has been the past few times i've set my camera up but look y'all hold on okay y'all so this is currently my setup i got y'all set up kind of i had y'all propped up here so that i could prop the fucking lens up one pillow another pillow and another pillow and yeah also let's get this tripod open and let's see what she's talking about so we can get y'all set up open her up okay honestly for some reason okay it's not that long for some reason in the camera or in on the box it's just giving like tentacles like th this stands up on the ground i don't know why i just it just seems so big but let's see what else cam oh this is for like your phone you know like if you want to put your phone up on there um i think this is also for your phone no it's not oh cool they have a little remote that also comes with this like if you're trying to take pictures or record videos you can use your remote instead of having like 
use a timer or something. We're gonna take this, flip her up, I'm assuming. Yup, 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 yup. Tighten her up. And then, hold on. Hello, hello. Hello, guys. How does it feel to be on a tripod that I like? I can actually like set y'all up on because you can move the legs. I didn't even show y'all. Oh my god. Oh, cool beans. I'm excited. I'm excited. All right. Yes. This is what I'm talking about. This is where I really wanted this angle to be because I feel like I'm looking down. I was looking down, but yes. <sighs> hold on. I'm excited now because this is really what I was. Yes, yes, yes. Hello, hello. It's actually kind of cool. I don't, know, I don't know if you guys can see on the box, but y'all see how like the legs can like. I, I don't think I'm gonna need to wrap it around like this on the pole, but it just shows you what this can really do. Thank you guys so much for watching today's YouTube video. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it, even though y'all may feel like it was all over the place because it kind of was. So maybe that's the whole point. Y'all supposed to see what it's really like because I'm a chaotic person, but it's okay. I enjoyed it. So like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And yeah, see you guys in the next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.